and show I, them. And then I safety pinned Ellie by accident, like her skin, yeah. and she's crying. <laughs> yeah, Molly three days a week. Like, every single day. There was no other teacher besides Molly. <laughs> Can you imagine? Do you have a fave group this year so far? Yeah. Yeah. It's the one I watched, right? Yeah. It's really good. <laughs> and then Brisson, Brisson came off the stage and was like, oh my god, I don't know what to do with my improv. Nice. So you can cheat off of each yeah. other. Yeah. Do yeah. you? Yeah, and we got in trouble for it. Yeah. You guys always get called out together at Project. Do you ever, like, fight over who goes center? Can you guys talk about my fish? Oh. Being oh, back being to back toss top. with who? Sam Vine. <laughs> what if what if Berkeley improv for you for top ten got top three and I'm then like, you did the solo? I hope no one from Break the Floor is watching this. Like Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? Stop Talking Ken's episode 14. I'm here with my favorite people ever. Like, they already know. They're literally my favorite people ever. Okay, and also, oh wait, my sisters were on. But it's special because there's two in one. It's like a two in one deal right now. Like, two guests at one time. Okay, do you want to introduce yourselves? Sure. I'm Briston. And I'm Berkeley. Who's older? Me. Berkeley. I'm only by one minute, though. Like, barely. So, like, you don't even consider being the youngest? Yeah. Well, no. she is younger, though. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay. So, you guys just moved to California, kind of. Yeah. Like, recently. Yeah. Where did you used to live? In Kansas. Do you guys remember our first encounter? No. <laughs> you don't? No. I do, kind of. Where were we? Like, at that dinner place? Yeah, yeah. We are Wood yeah. Ranch at the Spectrum. Oh, yeah. My sisters met them first because, what was it, like Nouveau, Kansas yeah. City? Yeah. But I was sick, so I didn't go. And the mm-hmm. twins went. Yeah. <laughs> Basically, my sisters came home, and they were very excited to have met twins. And trust me, I got a lot of Snapchats. I feel like <laughs> we already had a Snapchat group by then. Yeah. yeah. Like, I, like, definitely was having FOMO because <laughs> I was like, I should be there. But I was really excited to meet you guys because I didn't even know you were going to move to California at that point. And now we're, like, best friends because I see them every single day. <laughs> I see them more than my mom. <laughs> like, literally. Okay. How old were you guys when you started dancing? Okay, so basically, we were a toddler and we took a class. Yeah. And then I don't think we liked it, yeah, we so we like played it. soccer. Yeah, we played but soccer. But then when we moved to Kansas four years ago, yeah, we oh, took... so you didn't always live in Kansas? No, we were born in San Diego. Yeah, we were born here, but then we moved to Kansas. But then, like, yeah, that's when we took our first dance class. Okay, let me get this straight. You lived in California, you took dance, you hated it. <laughs> then you moved to Kansas, you took dance and you loved it. Yeah. And now you're back in California. Yeah. yeah. And you love dance. Yeah. <laughs> wow. How long did you guys live in Kansas and how did you guys like get back into dance and like start loving it? So we lived in Kansas for four years. Yeah. But then like we got back into dance because like our aunt told us about a studio. And so we were like, well, let's just try it again. And, and like, see if we like it. And then yeah. we loved, loved it, it. And that's how we just started it again. Have you guys always grown up, like, dancing together and, like, playing soccer together? Like, doing everything together? Yeah. yeah like- so, my sisters started with duets because they never wanted to compete against each other with solos. But did you guys start with a duet or did you do solos against each other right away? Well, we, we started, started with a duet, duet and, and then, then next year we did solos yeah. and a duet. When we were and then- nine, we did our solos. And I did, like, contemporary and she did jazz. Won? Well, it's, it's like, like switch like, every, yeah, time. every time. Every <laughs> time. So we weren't really like ever competitive with each other in solos. Yeah, just like the duets is better because like everyone wins or everyone loses. That's so cute. <laughs> I agree. I feel like you guys like always switch though. Yeah. Like there's not like one like star. You <laughs> both are stars. <laughs> Duh. So now, after living in Kansas for four years, we're flashing forward to moving back to California. What made you guys decide that project was where you wanted to continue your dance training? Well, there's like a bunch of studios in California, but our oh, like Ellie, yeah, Ellie, our long-term like family friend, went to project, and so she's and like, so we were just like, okay, we'll like try it out, and we took the intensive, and then we like we loved, loved it. it. So then we auditioned, and then we went to project. 
that makes sense but obviously it's because i'm there and i'm their favorite person to see <laughs> yeah, every day definitely. we actually have a lot of bonding time this yeah. year because their privates are like before my class yeah. So I'm always sitting with one of them, and we're, like, talking about things we can't talk about on here, but, but, like, that's literally what we do. Okay, so I went to Project when I was your age, which is just so crazy, but I remember it was always so much fun, but we had Molly three days a week, like, every single day. There was no other teacher besides Molly. Can you imagine? Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Molly. Oh, my gosh. That'd be fun. (laughs) But, But... I remember we, well, it was a lot smaller, like, projects, so there was a lot less people, but the classes were definitely very intimate and scary, like, for (laughs) sure. But what are some of your, this being your second year, what are some of your favorite moments that you've had so far? Like, Like the Christmas party, the banquet, nationals. Under Pressure being one of our dances was really fun. And River Deep was fun, too. Oh, River Deep. Guys, this (laughs) dance was so good. It was a really good dance. Under Pressure was good, too, but I really liked River Deep. Yeah. If you had to pick your favorite group so far. Like, for this year, too? Well, you can't name any of them. They have to be surprised for everyone. But do you have a favorite group this year so far? Yeah. Yeah. It's the one I watched, right? Yeah. It's really good. Guys, it's It's really good. Ellie slays. Ellie slays. You guys do, too, but she slays that dance for sure. Yeah. If you had to pick from last year, what would be your favorite group dance? Uh, mine probably would be Under Pressure. And mine probably River Deep because it was, like, really fun. Yeah. yeah. My favorite memory from Under Pressure is trying to rip all of you guys' gloves <laughs> yeah, on. they're, like, sticky. They Because they not never would off. fit. And then, like, I safety pinned and then I safety pinned someone, apparently. Oh, Ellie. Wasn't it oh, Ellie? Yeah. And yeah. she's, like, crying. <laughs> Molly, like, had me safety. Everyone's gloves were way too big. They're so big. So she was, like, Ken's, help me safety yeah, pin so, them. Yeah, like, Hildy can sell them. And then I safety pinned Ellie by accident, like, her yeah. skin. And she's crying. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> it's It was only your first year. You both made top 20. I just want everyone to know I'm really upset no one has a video of my reaction <laughs> and then us backstage. Basically, I think it was Berkeley who got announced first for top 20. Yeah. And then I was like, oh my God, like screaming. <laughs> then it was Briston and I started running backstage, okay? But then Briston got called for top 10. <laughs> I thought he was crying. <laughs> and then Briston, Briston came off the stage and was like, oh my God, I don't know what to do with my improv. And then, <laughs> and then Berkeley was like, yeah, she doesn't know what to do. <laughs> Berkeley was like, I don't know what she's gonna do. She has nothing ready. <laughs> it was so funny. Like it was amazing. It was chaotic. It was so chaotic. It was so funny. <laughs> that is seriously such an accomplishment. Like it only being your first year, first time junior. <laughs> first time was it your first time at TDA Nationals? Second no, time? Second. Yeah, like so like young. Mm-hmm. And I just think it's crazy. But are you guys excited for nationals this year? Yes. yes. Are you ready to do even better this year. (laughs) Yeah. Come out with a bang. (laughs) So obviously California has a lot of opportunities like Kansas and I feel like you guys have already done so much in LA. Mm -hmm. So like what are some things that you've like experienced like from living here? Well, we signed with like the block agency thing. Yeah, and like Prod 21 was like really amazing for California. Yeah, yeah. Do you guys like go out to LA and audition? Do you want to be actors? Well, yeah. Yeah? Actually? Kinda. Singers. Kinda. No. No. (laughs) Yeah, I've heard them sing. (laughs) Or like dancers for like backup for Taylor Swift. Oh yeah, duh. Obviously. So you guys like, well I feel like with Project like, there's not like a ton of time to be like driving to LA, but like do you guys audition in LA? Well like like, the thing. Okay, yeah, like, they, like, like, film it at home. Oh, yeah, yeah. They just, like, tapes. send it. Yeah. But then sometimes we go to, like, L.A. with, like, Mackie. Oh, yeah. And just do photo shoots. Her, and, like, she slays. We she love She slays. Her. We do love her. We do. You guys are cute little five ambassadors, <laughs> and there are about 100,000 dance wear lines now, and I feel like every dancer is a model for something. <laughs> but how did you guys end up with five? Well, like, we've always loved their outfits. Like, they fit yeah, and, like, amazing. Yeah, and, I don't know, we just, like love them and like they just like you know that's an ass and we're like yes we were so excited yeah and so we did some photo shoots with them and like michelle the owner she's so nice she's like and amazing we went to like their five world intensive thing during the oh, weekend did you like that yeah, yeah it was, really, it was fun. really fun was it like mini junior teen room like that yeah it was like, like mini mini junior, junior teens, teens and seniors. seniors really yeah yeah like, it there was, was like, an audition. audition. There was an audition? Yeah. yeah. Did you audition? No. no we Why? couldn't, because we were five. We just did it on the stage. Yeah. Was the audition, like, to be a five model? 
No, I think. No. Could you imagine? There was like, I think there were like. I don't even know there was four. I, I think it was like four. probably like ships or like a gift card for something oh. off or something <laughs> like that. I don't know. Uh, then like the Sullivan twins, they oh, came right, out the right. line and it was like really fun. And they were twins. there. Yeah. yeah and they were Your there. twins. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but like, yeah. It was and really they fun. performed and they're yeah, so they good. They performed and they're really good. So next five world, I'll come, but only yeah. if you guys are performing. Because <laughs> I'm not coming otherwise. Okay. 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 You'll work on it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Are you guys going to come out with a collection? I don't know. Like, in the works? <laughs> They're all staring at me. Like, I'm literally crazy. <laughs> so, do you guys go to an in-person school, or are you homeschooled? So, like, okay, it's an online My program. Yeah. But we do it at our we, country club. Yeah, so because like, there's a teacher from England that teaches us. It's basically, like, a tennis and school academy. Because my brother plays tennis. And so he does a tennis part, too. But we only do the school part. So we just asked if we could do the school proportion and then leave. Proportion. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, a teacher comes. And, like, we, all of our work is on the computer. But, like, a teacher comes and helps us with it. If we have any questions, and we, like, leave at 1130. Berkeley smarter, right? No. Yes. yes. I have better grades. Yeah, but like, okay, no. I'm so I much have smarter. better grades. Okay, give us like a day in the life. What time do you go yeah. to school? What time do you go to dance? When do you see me in the middle? <laughs> so, so we, we like, wake, wake up, up and then we go to school like around 8 30. 30. And then mm-hmm. we do our work. Yeah. And we usually get picked up at like 11 11 30 to 12 like 12. 30. It depends on what my mom has. Yeah. And then we yeah. just go home and chill. Yeah. And then we leave to dance at like. It's different it's every a, day. It's different every day, but it's like, it's like 3.30, 3.30, 3.30, and 4.30. And 5.30. And 5.30. Different, well, well, not 5.30. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> but and then we see you. And then we see Ken's, and it's that's so our amazing. highlight of the day. Duh. Yeah. And then, and then we, go we go to class, dance, and then we and get, get out at 9.30. And then we drive home and, and go, go to, to bed. <laughs> um, like, are there other people who do your school with you, or is it just you two? There's like, us two, my us brother, and then so we do our brother. There's, like, seven kids. So, but, like, we're it. the only non-tennis people. So, it's, like, us two, and my brother, and then there's, like, this girl, and then there's this other girl, and then there's, like, a little seven-year-old that does it. Yeah, and then we all just do it, and yeah. Yeah, and... <laughs> do you take tests in person? No. But we do it online. online. So you can cheat off of each yeah. other. Yeah. Do you? Yeah, yeah. and we got in trouble for it. Yeah, we got in trouble. So we had to redo it. And she like called my mom. And she was like, Your yeah, girls have similar answers. And we're like, Well, maybe because we have the same questions. Yeah. <laughs> so you had to redo the test? Yeah, yeah but, but I put the same answers as I did before. Same. I was like, And then she graded it. It gave her a higher grade than me, and we had the same answers. I was like, What? This That's is rude. not fair. Yeah. That is not fair. No. Mm-mm. Okay. You guys are obviously twins. Yeah. <laughs> what is, like, what do you feel like the dynamic is, like, growing up being twins? Because I wouldn't know. I'm not a twin. Well, it's, like, good. Because you have, like, a built-in best friend. Like, you have someone if you don't have anyone. Like, when we go to conventions and we don't have anyone. Oh, that's like, we so can nice. See? Do you other. remember when I was all <laughs> alone? I, guys, I was all alone. And I called Berkeley Brisson and I was like, whatever class you're in, you will not be taking it. Because you will be eating <laughs> dinner with me. Because I have no friends in the senior room. And then we went and we ate dinner. Yeah. And then got your food. Yeah. And I started crying. Remember? <laughs> oh my god! Your room was like outside almost. Yeah, yeah it was cool. so cold. Yeah. It's, it's uh, it was not. That's like a dark time. I don't really want to think about it that much. <laughs> your guys' relationship is really interesting to me because you guys are sometimes so mean to each other, but you literally are like the best of friends. Like it actually makes no sense at all. Yeah. Like I don't understand it. Like we just get mad at each other and like the really next day easily. we're fine. We sometimes are best friends. Like, I go on her shoulders we're putting lights over our room for Christmas. But like, and then the next week, she woke me up at 11.30 so I could unplug the lights. And I was sleeping, and she was do reading. Do you guys still, like, bunk. alternate who sleeps on the top bunk? Yeah. And who... After, like, I just got, she just to, the got to the bottom bunk. She literally has been on the bottom bunk for, like, nine months. And I just got to the bottom. So now I'm have to be on the top bunk. But you guys don't like to be on the top? But I like being on the top, though, because, like, the dog doesn't have to, like, jump on my bed because he jumped on her bed. <laughs> But like, and also, I don't like the stairs. They're like really steep. Yeah, and well, they're just stairs. But like when I'm tired, I don't want to like climb. When you guys like, you guys always get called out together at project. Do you ever like no. fight over who goes center? No, no. I always just make her. Yeah, because like, like I mess up, up, and I'm like, bro. Because if I bro. mess up, <laughs> yeah, I just like don't want to mess up. So I'm just like, okay, you go center, so I can watch you. I love like. Sometimes Molly will be like, Berkeley, go. Brisson, go. And then they high five when you're running out. Because you like run to like go do your combo. And then they like high five in the middle. <laughs> it's really wholesome. That's what Loyla and I do too. <laughs> so, where do you feel like dance is taking you in your future? Um, like, 
I don't know. Like I college, don't. professional. I want, I want to be on like the college dance team, like yeah. when the people play football. Like, oh, so you want to be like a song girl, like where the like the pom poms, like that. <laughs> yeah, like well, at the football games. Like, yeah, I want to be on the football game, but I don't want to be a cheerleader. I just want to like dance, like okay, some yeah, girls yeah. that dance. Yeah, yeah. And also, I get like close up tickets to the football game, so I want to go to UCLA though, because like my dad coaches. Yeah, yeah. and it's really cool. Yeah, it's close to the house. I don't want to go far. Yeah. So you guys, do you guys want to go to the same college? Yeah, we're probably going to. You guys want to go to the same college and like roommate together? Yeah. yeah. Really? Like, I want to go our dorms too. Yeah. Okay, so, so we, we can just be, be together. Dorm. Yeah. I don't want to be with a random person. No. What are you guys gonna do if like one of you goes to like Juilliard, and the other? We're gonna go, go to the same. Yeah. You are. Yeah. Like. Okay. I we'll think do so. an update, guys, when they graduate from college, <laughs> on this very location, and we'll do a college reveal for you guys. Okay. Yeah. Do you guys want to go to Juilliard? No. Like, okay, it's like, like, it's fit. Isn't it like ballet? Yeah. And like modern? Yeah. Yeah, but like, then I'd be sad because like, like, there'd be no there's jazz. There's no jazz. Yeah, and like, you guys, know. and you guys, like, your fa- what's your favorite style of dance? Jazz. Contemporary. But then I like jazz Yeah, too. see, Berkeley's a jazz, like, favorite, and then Brisson's contemporary. I do know this. Yeah. But like, if, I don't know, maybe when we're older, like, our mornings will change. Because, yeah. like, I feel like older kids, like, do more contemporary. Yeah, I guess. Like, you might, like, fall in love with ballet and want to be a prima ballerina. Doubtful. Yeah, because, like, all the times I've spent with both of them in the Project 21 <laughs> studio, and then Berkeley's like, Brisson, get up! We have to go to ballet! And then no. you're like, she no! Was, it's no. always where she makes us, like, we have to get yeah. And then she's like, Berkeley, let's go. I'm like, no, I want to stay here longer. Yeah, Berkeley's like, always like, I'm not going to ballet. And then Brisson's like, <laughs> get up. Her. And then she's like, Mom, Berkeley's not going to ballet. And, and then, then I get texts from my dad saying, go to ballet. I'm like, what? Yeah, it's like a daily routine. Like, seriously. Now we're going to do rapid fire questions. <laughs> so, like, I'm going to say it, you can answer, and then you can elaborate if you want to. Okay. Okay. Who is your favorite choreographer? Chantal, Chantal or Molly. Do you want to elaborate on that or like no? We just like love them. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what are your favorite colors? Blue. Pink. Blue. She likes, well, I kind of like pink, but like I like baby pink and like baby blue. Like I just like any kind of pink. I like, yeah. If you could have a duet partner with anyone, who would you choose? Like dream duet partner. Like other than each other? Yeah. Like you can't choose each other. Um, Chantel. <laughs> you would do a du- duet with Chantel. Yeah. She's really Which good. she choreographed it too. Yes. <laughs> so she would choreograph herself or like a trio. Yeah, a trio. A trio. Well, you, you, with you. A trio. I want a trio yeah. with you. Yeah, watch, it's happening. <laughs> watch, that happens over their duet this year. <laughs> what even division would it be in? I think teen. Yeah. Because I'm senior, they're junior, even at teen. teen. Yeah. So it'd be, we'd be going against like Izzy Howard and like Easton. It's okay. <laughs> got it. Yeah, we got it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Who's like your number one inspiration? When, like, in dance, like, when you, like, watch videos, you're, like, this is who I want to dance, like. Like, a teacher or, like, a student? Like, either. You? You no. and your sisters and, like, Chantel yeah. and, like, Molly and, like, Avery. Yeah. Yeah. You guys are my inspirations. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, you each have to answer this on your own, okay? Okay. A pro and a con of me. There's there's no cons. Shut yeah. up. There literally is. There's none. Yes, there is. Pros, like, you're funny. Like, you're just you're so nice. amazing. Like, you're pretty. I go to dance and I'm like, okay, I can hang out with Ken's today. There's no cons. Yes, there is, guys. Think. No, there's not. Like, I literally don't know. I know, but can you, a con is that you're going to leave me. Who? A con is that you're going to oh. leave me yeah, next year. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's sad. Can you guys talk about my fish? Oh. I would talk. So we were learning our morning joy dance, and then all that. So we got this like five minute break, and all of a sudden there's a fish. And so like Ken's and Lola go to like tell Corey and Troy like we have a fish. So we're like, what? No, she doesn't. So we all went in the little area, and there it is, a koi fish, little thing, and a fish in it, like nothing. Just and it was like panicking, like running around, and then around. someone dropped a wheat then in the fish bowl, yeah. and ate it. And, it was, and I it was, was like, this is its death. Like, I was like, yeah. my fish is going to die. It was we like to be a goldfish, but I think it was a koi fish. Yeah, it was a koi it fish. It was a koi fish. She bought a goldfish, but yeah. it was a koi So a four dollar koi fish. fish. Yeah. yeah. So it was a lot, like 10 minutes what of just like freak, everyone freaking everyone out. Everyone was freaking out. Like, all the little fish. Corey? Yeah. Corey the koi fish. fish. <laughs> yes. And we were like, everyone was like, oh my gosh. Like, and, and then. Ken was like, what are we going to do? Yeah. And then 
I, my mom was like, you're giving the fish to Berkeley and Brisson. Like, you're not taking the fish home. And then I was like, yes, like, Blake would love the fish. Like, let's give it to them. And then they were like, no. So then I had to take this fish home. And they both were texting me all throughout yeah. the night. Like, did it survive? Did it survive? Like, we were at the UCLA game. And I was like, oh, my God, I had to ask Ken's about her fish. <laughs> they were yeah, very concerned. They knew. And then what yeah. happened? And then. <laughs> and then Berkeley was like, is your fish like, and then I she bought like, stuff. She bought yeah, stuff for yeah. fish. On Amazon, like, I overnighted it in panic. And, and then... How's like, your fish and you're, like, gone? No, she was like... I was like, is your fish alive? And she's like, yeah. And I was like, oh, that's good. And then she's like, yeah, but I don't have it anymore. Like, and then yeah, she's like, he's probably gone. dead. And, like, she, like, dropped it in, like, the sewer thing. Yeah. That goes through the ocean. I, like, unfortunately, <laughs> could not take responsibility. I am not a fish killer. <laughs> I just was, like, getting a little bit overwhelmed with the responsibilities of being a fish owner and a fish mom. Like, I wasn't ready to take that on. And I thought it would die, but it survived the night. Yeah. I don't know how it did. Okay. This was one, like, survival fish. Like, it was a lot. Wasn't it panicking? Like, yeah, it was, like, like, slamming itself into the glass. It was, like, glass. literally, like, trying to get out cycling. And then, like, next thing you know, you have a fish. Yes. And then, like, when Cammie and Katie came, like, their reactions are so funny. And they, like, they're <laughs> like, like, you not you guys alone anymore whilst we buy fishes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's, like, exactly what happened. It was really amazing. It was really funny. funny. Let's talk about when Briston got top 10 and Berkeley was <laughs> playing... Being oh, back being toss, back toss. With, with who? Sam Vine. <laughs> While Briston I didn't was. I know that it was him. Me, and like, I was like, Berkeley, what are you doing? And I, it was like, just like us, basically. Berkeley playing being bag toss with Sam Vine. And Briston like, trying to practice some tricks. Like, it was crazy. <laughs> and like, Ken's was like, okay, do this. Like, and it was like a lot. And then, like, when you got done, like, Briston was, was like, like, were you just playing with Sam Vine? And I was yeah. like, I did not know who it was. Yeah, she was just like so casually playing with him. And, like, he wasn't even preparing for his best dancer dance-off yeah. either. Like, hello, what was he doing? <laughs> like, Christian was, like, literally almost in tears that she had, like, gone stage and improv. It was crazy. Because we don't, I was like, like improv. I don't know what to do. Okay, so I'm just really confused on why you guys didn't switch. If <laughs> Berkeley, you think, is better at improv, you totally could have done that, and no one would have noticed well, at all. She's better at improv, but, like, she hates improv. Like, once you're improving in a class, I literally cried. What if, what if Berkeley improv for you for top ten got top three? And would, then you did the solo. I would just, like, improv for jazz and, like, run off and she get a contemporary. <laughs> they switch. do a little switch. That'd yeah. be amazing. No, but what if you guys did that? And then Berkeley got top three, but then you did your solo. Would you <laughs> consider it your win, then? Yes. Would. I would <laughs> consider it my <laughs> win. <laughs> I'd be like, yeah, that's mine. You could do a Change po- it. You could do a post being like, this I was know. a joint effort. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm so glad that Berkeley got top three for Bristol. <laughs> Yeah. Can we do that next year for you guys? Just like for like jazz, like if one of us makes up ten, just like I'll go on for jazz and just like run, so person can do contemporary. Yeah, <laughs> and then like whoever can do their solo. It's a great idea. If you ask yeah. me, it's a ten out of ten idea mm-hmm. because I would be the only one who know knew, and then your mom, yeah, yeah. and then Blakelyn would probably be screaming like that's Brittany, not Brittany, like that's literally what she'd she would be running up to the stage. Yeah, she'd be like, oh my god. Remember when Delaney, like, almost touched the stage? Yeah, and then, she, like, the people were getting so mad at her. She, like, touched the stage. TDA is a crazy time, yes. if you ask me. But, like, I love, like, just, like, watching everyone improv. It's funny. And fun. <laughs> it's funny. The boys senior improv. It's, it's funny. funny. Yeah. What is, like, a highlight from TDA? Um, probably just, like, being there and, like, making All the classes friends. are fun and just, like... Making Hanging out friends. with Ken. Made new friends. Like, yeah. Who? Like who? Uh, yeah, Berkeley doesn't know who they're eating. talked to other people. I don't remember their names. <laughs> really lifelong friends. Yeah, we met here. Yeah. <laughs> but hang out with you at TJ. Yeah. We, yeah. Oh, we went to the pool. Yeah. And then we didn't want to get in. But then your sisters pushed us in. I wasn't there. I was at the senior rehearsal. Oh, yeah. Do you guys think uh, I'm going to win TDA this year? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Wait, literally. That big plaque can go right there. <laughs> what would you even do if I was improving on the stage? I would literally scream. Stage and go like, this is me. I would literally like be screaming. I would and, like one of you guys go for me. <laughs> I don't know if I could handle it either. Like, I personally don't think I could handle it. Improv. Yeah. When we did it at your house. No, oh, and just gosh. like all the time. No, like all the no, times, like we'd in class. Improv. We'd improv. Oh, yeah. And then we'd always come early and we'd walk oh, you guys. Yeah. Like, we would improv, like, towards the end of the year, we start working on improv, kind of. That was my worst nightmare. Yeah, mine too. And, um, like, Molly would have the little kids come in and, like, watch a couple people improv. 
Oh, yeah. yeah. I remember that. Oh, yeah. Scary times. Mm-hmm. And, like, we had to do it, and I was like, once, like, we just devoted a whole class time for improv. Really? A whole hour and a half to yes. improv? And I was like, oh, we my God. Like, jazz five times, and then, like, contemporary Oh, five my times. God. And, like, I was like, I can't. We've never done that. We've only done it, like, twice. Like, that's it. Like, I can't even. Like, last year, we switched off every day. So one day we learned a combo, and then the other day we did improv. Like, yeah, in contemporary. Oh my gosh, that's the class I literally oh, cried in. Contemporary. Who did you have? Talia. Oh, we didn't have. We didn't. I literally have her. cried because I had it improv. Mm-hmm. Like, I wasn't like she. Oh, well, you did cry. What if you did, did, cry. I did cry? Yeah, she I, like, did cry. I can't. <laughs> falling, and she ran to the bathroom. And then, like the teacher was like, "Are you okay?" I was like, "I don't want to do improv." And then oh, I yeah. still had to do it. I do it. remember someone telling me that you literally did cry. I did. Why? It's, it doesn't even matter. I don't like it. I just like it's my little nightmare. Do you guys like our new teachers this year, Corey and Choi? Yeah. yeah. They're so good. Like, yeah. amazing. I've been taking their class the past couple of weeks. Interesting. Do you know our group dance, like what it is about? Oh, yeah. Can I even say? Yeah, like give a hint. I do know. They all like ran and told We're me. dead on Mount Everest. And yeah. our bodies so, like, are like. Wait, stop. Okay. So basically like there's a Mount Everest <laughs> thing. and like It's a mountain. A yeah. mountain. And. <laughs> Yeah, someone called it a hill. But, like, it's really high up, and, like, when some people, like, don't make it, yeah, they, like, they can't it's too high to get down. them down. So, like, they, just they use it as directions. Yeah, so, like, we're, like, the green jacket that. turned left. Yeah. So, like, I, like, like, don't get it. I didn't get it when you told me. Like, the people are landmarks. I still landmarks don't get it now. And, like, the landmarks. the landmarks that who are dead. Are the landmarks? So you're saying the, the people. The dead people. But who are the dead people? Us. <laughs> but you just said you're the directors. No, the dead people are the directors. Like, they're no, dead. Like, so they're dead. And and they're like, like, when you see green jacket, turn left. Yeah. Like, when you see the body that has a green jacket, you turn left. Wait, so wait. you're the dead people? Yeah. In yeah. the dance? Yeah. yeah. Or is everyone a dead person? I think. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, I think. Do you guys have any big, exciting projects coming up that we can stay tuned for? Uh, just sing you at dance. <laughs> That's big and exciting. It's no, but, like, new solos. Oh, uh, yeah. I have a new... I'm learning how... I have... Well, I've learned half of my new Molly solo. Yeah, and then I've learned my new Chantal one. It's called, like, something. That means getting lost in Spanish. Oh. <laughs> and yeah. mine's Cornet Man. <gasps> it's, like, musical theater. Do you like it? Yeah. Better than it's, L-O-V-E? It's really hard. It's, like, harder I'm, than oh L-O-V-E. God. I've already learned some of it. Oh. She, like, really yeah, she always learns my solos and then does them with me. <laughs> it's so annoying. <laughs> Yeah. My, do you know what my favorite part from your solo was last year? You know, yeah. See, Brissa knows and it wasn't even her solo. It was my favorite part, guys. Like, I would make Berkeley practice it so much before oh she went on stage because I didn't want her to mess it up. I need to figure out where I can wink in this one. <gasps> yeah. I'll work on it with you. Okay. We'll do some privates. <laughs> okay. Tell everyone all of your social medias, like, so they can follow you. Okay. On Instagram, it's Cypress Twins. And Spell then on- it. S-C-I-F-R-E-S-T-W-I-N-S. And it's the same on TikTok. That's so the same Instagram and TikTok. Yeah. Okay, now I need to give you guys merch. <laughs> okay. It's I'm like, thinking, like, different colors, like, so you can yeah, share. so cute. So you can share, you know? Okay. Like, but I feel like Brisson should have this one because she's favorite color is blue yeah, yeah. and so then cute. i don't have a pink one like sorry Berkeley. like i'll work on that for you but like look it's, it's so cute, cute. Like, that's my new wardrobe i wear sweatshirts like every day yeah good and the ones that like you guys like do you want a gray i love this one they're so Everyone soft like this merch it's actually yeah amazing. it's like literally it's, like, the actually not for sale you'll ever see oh. Oh. <laughs> But, like, so it's, like, exclusive to you. Oh, so, like, if you see people wearing it, you know that, like... They're on your podcast. They're, like, one. A real one, you know? A real one. They're a real one. Yeah. Yeah. It's so cute. Yeah. My new wardrobe. Thank you. Okay. Thank you guys so much for coming. (laughs) And we will do an update updated podcast after national so stay tuned and we'll have even more things to talk about we'll be able to see if they switch bots maybe they'll both make top 10 so they won't have to switch bots or oh i have an idea for jazz you can do it twice and then you can do the contemporary <laughs> yeah. twice oh yeah that's if a good they both idea make top tw- 10 that's a good idea that's a good idea i hope no one from break the floor is watching this like we're <laughs> kidding <laughs> Just disclaimer. Not really. I would totally do that, but yeah, I um, would too. We'll do an updated podcast so we can recap on this whole season we have ahead of us. I'll be like committed to college. Yeah. Maybe I'll be going to college with your dad. 
Um, <laughs> and then we'll talk about nationals. So stay tuned. Make sure you guys subscribe and stay tuned for next Friday's video. Bye.